everyone, my name is Anna and I run the YouTube channel called Klana Net and today I'm here with makingmusicmag.com and today we're going to be showing you all how to play the F major scale on the clarinet so stay tuned. Now this is the last major scale when you go around the circle of fifths and it's the 12th scale and it's going to have one flat in it which is going to be B flat so instead of playing that as a natural note you're going to lower it a half step and play that as B flat instead. And if you're new here, then be sure to stay tuned next week because Cassidy here at Making Music is going to be showing you all how to play the relative minor scale, which is D minor to this major F scale. You don't want to miss out on that, so be sure to come back next week and hang out with Cassidy. Now that all being said, let's move on to the F major scale. Today we are going to be learning how to play both octaves of the F major scale. So today we're starting off with the note F, and how you play F is you have these three down, these three down, and your pinky right here on the slower key on the clarinet, as well as your thumb covering the back keyhole right here. And this is how you play F, which is our first note in the scale. And this is what it sounds like. Next we are playing G, so all we're doing is lifting that pinky up like so. Everything else stays the same. Your back thumb is covering that back keyhole right there, and this is G. And from here on out through the scale, we're basically lifting one finger at a time. But this, for now, is G. <laughs> Next, we are playing A, and all we're doing is lifting that bottom finger like so. Everything else stays the same as before, and this is how you play A. <laughs> Again, we are lifting the bottom most note, and this is going to be B flat. So, this is what it is going to sound like, and this is how we play B flat. Next, we are playing C, so all we're doing is lifting that pointer finger up, so only these three should be down on the left hand, and this is C. Next, we are lifting that finger like so, so only these two are down, and this is how we play D. Next, we are lifting that bottom note again once more. This is a pretty easy, simple scale, and this is how we play E. And finally, for the first octave, all we're doing is lifting that pointer finger up, and only our back keyhole is covered by our thumb, and this is how we play F, which is the final note in the first octave of the scale. And this is F. And that is how we play the first octave. So now let's go back down to the beginning. Remember, we're basically lifting one finger at a time, and we are playing F, lift G, lift A, lift B flat, lift C, lift D, lift E, and then lift this top finger, have this back keyhole covered at all times, and this is the final note, which is octave F. So now we are just going to run through the first octave slowly, and here we go. <laughs> you play the first octave now let's move on to the second octave okay so beginning the second octave of F major we are going to start where we stopped in the first octave we're gonna have our thumbs right here in the back of the keyhole like before and this is F of course once more and this is the first note of the second octave next we are lifting that completely so that only we have an open note like so, and this is going to be G, which is the next note in the F major scale. So we have nothing pressed down, and this is what it sounds like. Next, we're playing A, so only our pointer finger is pressing down on this front key right here, like so. 
nothing else is pressed down just this key right here and this is a next is b flat once again and all we're doing is we're keeping our pointer finger pressed down on this key right here as well as having our back thumb pressing down on this back register key right here so these are both going to be pressed down at the same time and this is B flat and this is what it sounds like next we are playing C so we're going from here to a large jump where we have all of our fingers down on both our right and left hand Plus, the back key hole is being covered and pressing down on the register key at the same time. And then we are having our pinky right here on this key of the clarinet, like so. And this is the next note. All of this work will take us to our next note, which is C. So this is what it sounds like. Next, we are lifting our finger like so. Everything else stays the exact same. All fingers are down. Back and register keys are pressed down and being covered from here on out. And this is D. Next, we are playing E, which we are just lifting that finger like so. And everything else stays the exact same. We're just lifting the bottommost finger. And this is E. And this is what it sounds like. And finally, the final note in the second octave is F, and we are just lifting this note like so, so only these three are down. Our pointer key is pressed down, back and register keys are pressed down and covered, and this is our last note, which is F. And that is the second octave of the F major scale. So now we're going to review the notes from the beginning of the second octave and then play the scale. So first note is F right here, which is just our back keyhole being covered by our thumbs. And then we are lifting that so nothing is being pressed down. This is G and then our pointer finger is pressing down on this front key, which is A. And then we are adding, in addition to the front key, this back register key, which our thumb is going to press down on. And this is B flat. And then we are making a quick jump. So all of these keys are covered and this key is pressed down by our pinkies. Meanwhile, our back and register keys are being covered as well. And this is C. So from C, we are lifting the bottom most finger one at a time. So we have C and then lift D, lift E, and finally lift F. And so now let's go back down to the beginning of the second octave and play through it up to the top. Here we go. we've learned both octaves let's go back down to the very beginning and play through both octaves non-stop if you need to pause this video to review some of the notes from earlier please go ahead and do so and then come back to this part and then we can play the scale slowly together but for now if you're confident just keep on watching and grab your clarinets and play along here we go <laughs> Congratulations, you all. You have now just mastered both octaves of the F major scale. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. If you're new to the making music community, then be sure to check out 
our other clarinet scale tutorials that we have on here. We have the rest of the scales linked down below for both major and minor, so you can feel free to check any of those out. And again, be sure to come back next week and Cassidy is going to show you how to play the D minor scale here on makingmusicmagazine.com. So be sure to check back in next Wednesday. And that all being said, this concludes the clarinet major scale tutorial series here on makingmusicmag.com. I had a lot of fun hanging out with you all and I hope you did too. Thank you all so much for watching if you've stuck around from the beginning of the year and I will see you on the next one and on my YouTube channel. Bye everyone.